everyone welcome to my youtube channel ncrt math sub today in this video we will do worksheet number 43 for class 9 subject mathematics so in this video we are going to learn about the volume of right circular cylinder so let's begin children so required previous knowledge is understanding of cylinder area of circle volume and prism so that student hame पता होना चाहिए सिलेंडर के बारे में एरिया ऑफ सर्कल क्या होता पता होना चाहिए वॉल्यूम क्या होता पता होना चाहिए एंड प्रिज्म के बारे में पता होना चाहिए सो दैट हम पढ़ पाए वॉल्यूम ऑफ राइट सर्कुलर सिलेंडर सो चिल्ड्रन यू नो दैट द मेजर ऑफ स्पेस ऑक्यूपाइड बाय थ्री डायमेंशनल ऑब्जेक्ट और शेप इज कॉल्ड एज इस वॉल्यूम सो सिलेंडर इज प्रिज्म विद सर्कुलर बेस सिलेंडर क्या है एक प्रिज्म है विद सर्कुलर बेस सो दे फोर वॉल्यूम ऑफ सिलेंडर विल भी इक्वल्स टू एरिया ऑफ बेस सर्कल दैट इज पाई आर स्क्वायर एंड हाइट ऑफ सिलेंडर दैट इज एच सो दैट पाई आर स्क्वायर एच विल बी द वॉल्यूम ऑफ सिलेंडर सो वॉल्यूम ऑफ सिलेंडर इक्वल्स टू पाई आर स्क्वायर एच क्यूबिक यूनिट सो नाउ चिल्ड्रन लेट्स सॉल्व सम मोर एग्जाम्पल्स फॉर द बेटर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ द वॉल्यूम ऑफ सिलेंडर सो विद एग्जाम्पल वन यू कैन सी हेयर इन ऑन द स्क्रीन ए पेशेंट इन द हॉस्पिटल इज गिवन सोप डेली इन ए सिलेंडिकल बॉल ऑफ डायमीटर सेवन सेंटीमीटर इफ द बॉल इज फिल्ड विद द सोप टू ए हाइट ऑफ फोर सेंटीमीटर how much soup the hospital has to prepare daily to serve to 50 patients so now the solution part you can see radius of bowl is half of the diameter that is 7 by 2 that is 3.5 cm and height of soup in the bowl is height that is h equals to 4 cm as soup is in the cylindrical bowl so therefore the volume of bowl of soup will be v1 equals to pi r square h that is pi 22 by 7 radius is 7 by 2 so that 7 by 2 into 7 by 2 and height is Four, so that one fifty-four centimeter cube will be the volume of soup for one patient. So for two fifty patients, the total volume of two fifty bowls of soup will be V two fifty. That is two fifty into one fifty-four. That is volume of soup in each bowl. So that three thirty-eight thousand five hundred centimeter cube will be the volume of soup for two fifty patients. So this is all about example number one. So now we have example number two. You can see on the screen. A lead pencil consists of a cylinder of wood with solid cylinder of graphite filled in the interior. The diameter of pencil is seven mm, that is seven millimeter, and the diameter of graphite is one mm. The length of pencil is fourteen centimeter. Find the volume of wood and that of graphite. So, हमें क्या find out करना है? Volume of wood find out करना है and that of graphite. Graphite का volume भी find out करना है. Here the pencil is in the form of cylinder, which is made up of an outer cylinder of wood that is with radius r. We can assume this radius as capital R, and an interior cylinder of graphite that is radius r small r. So height of pencil that is length of pencil equals to 14 centimeter. So h equals to 14 centimeter. So now radius of pencil that is outer outer diameter we have 7 centimeter. So the radius will be 7 by 2. That is 3.5 mm. So 0.35 mm. 3.5 cm sorry and radius that is 1 by 2 mm that is 0.5 mm so this will be 0.05 cm so now volume of graphite will be pi r square h that is 22 by 7 into 0.05 0.05 into 14 equals to 0.11 cm cube this is the volume of graphite now volume of wood will be the total volume of pencil minus volume of graphite so that volume of wood will be equals to pi r capital r square h minus pi small r square h so that this will be 5.28 cm cube after simplifying so this is all about the example number 2 you can see and understand so now we have two questions for practice so first one is a soft drink is available in two packs a tin can with the rectangular base of length 5 cm and width 4 cm and height of 15 cm and another pack is a plastic cylinder with base diameter 7 cm and height 10 cm which container has greater capacity and by how much so we have two packs or you can say two packets uh, two containers one is cuboidal shape and other is cylindrical pack so we are to find the capacity and by how much they differ in the capacity so we can see first one first pack is of cuboidal shape you can see on the screen here with the length as 5 cm breadth as 4 cm and height as 15 cm so first of all mention all the given things so length of tin can that is length equals to 5 cm breadth of tin can equals to 4 cm height of tin can equals to 15 cm so capacity of tin can that is the volume of cuboid will be equals to lbh so that is length into breadth into height so this will be 300 cm cube this is the volume of cuboidal pack so now the diameter of cylindrical pack we have 7 cm so that radius of cylindrical pack will be 7 by 2 cm and height of cylindrical pack will be 
that is given is 10 cm so volume of cylindrical pack will be pi r square h that is pi we have 22 by 7 radius 7 by 2 and radius 7 by 2 into height that is 10 so put all the values here in this formula that is pi 22 by 7 radius that is 7 by 2 7 by 2 into height that is 10 so we will get 385 centimeter cube as the volume of cylindrical pack so you can see here they are difference is 85 centimeter cube so we can say that the cylindrical container has greater capacity by 385 minus 300 equals to 85 centimeter cube so this is all about question number one so now move ahead for question number two the inner diameter of cylindrical wooden pipe is 24 centimeter and its outer diameter is 28 centimeter the length of pipe is 35 centimeter find the volume of pipe so we are given outer diameter of pipe is 28 centimeter and outer radius will be that is capital R equals to 28 by 2 becomes 14 centimeter and inner diameter of pipe is 24 centimeter that's why inner radius of pipe will be 24 by 2 that is equals to 12 centimeter so now length of pipe we have given as 35 centimeter you can see on the screen so now volume of pipe will be outer volume of pipe minus inner volume of pipe so that pi r square h will be replaced by length of pipe that is l so pi r square l minus pi r square l so outer volume minus inner volume so now you can see pi l into r square minus small r square so put all the values here you can see pi is 22 by 7 and l is the length of pipe that is 35 and capital r that is outer radius is 14 and inner radius that is 12 so you can see 7 5 is 35 so we'll get 110 in the outer part and here in the bracket you can see a square minus b square become a plus b and into a minus b for is you can use this identity so or you can directly do the squaring or you can use this identity so this will be 26 and this will be here 2 so after simplifying you can see you will get 5720 cubic centimeter so this is volume of pipe and this is all about question number two it's, so if you learn from this video then please do subscribe my channel and share this video as much as you can thanks for watching